This weekend, we reported on a 200 acre fire south of Parachute near Battlement Mesa. Today, in our top story, the fire is still burning, and our Michael Lagerwell is standing by on scene with more details. Michael, what can you tell us? Rob, now I've gotten a bit of a different angle here so you can see the smoke really coming from the mountain over there from the Spring Creek fire, which as of earlier today was only approximately 212 acres of wilderness. We have about 150 personnel out on the fire right now and it's approximately 20% contained. Mike Jones is with the Upper Colorado River Intra-Agency Fire Management Unit and he tells me more crews are coming and so far no injuries or structure damage has been reported. Uh, there is a solar farm here that we're standing right at and there's some oil and gas infrastructure out here uh, but none of those structures have been damaged at this time. The only damage left behind is blackened trees and white ash blowing in the wind. But this isn't the only western slope spot fighting fires. Up north of Rifle, crews are fighting the Hubbard fire. We kept that at nine acres. We currently have crews on that fire as well. Jones said they're still investigating the causes of both the Spring Creek and Hubbard fire and have not yet ruled out human involvement. The, we haven't had much in the way of lightning lately, um, so it could be human caused fires, but we're, we're still investigating. Two fires in one weekend. Now that it's starting to get hot and dry and we're starting to get these winds, uh, the, those grasses are drying out. Hopefully these fires can serve as a cautionary tale for those out celebrating the 4th of July next week. We're really excited for people to get out and enjoy it, but we also want them to make sure that they're, they're careful as they're hauling their trailers and making sure that their chains are up high and that they're, they're crossed so they're not dragging. Hey, so I'm stepping behind the camera right now because I can see some flames on the mountain ridge right there. That fire is definitely raging up there. Now at the 5 p.m. show, UCR reported to me that just this afternoon, due to high winds and heat, the fire had expanded an approximate 20 to 40 acres. Now I reached out again right before at 6 p.m. They told me they have, they are continuing to work on the fire and additional resources have been over. But let let me zoom out and show just the entire tower of smoke there. Yeah, we're going to be here a long time tonight, folks. You want to tune in at the 630 on Fox. We'll have more updates then. Until now, from Battlement Mesa, reporting for KREX 5 News, I'm Michael Lagerwell. Rob? Thank you for your coverage, Michael.